Hi, and welcome back to Programming Like It's 1979. Before we go on to our writing of an assembler, I did want to have a few short videos which will be fun little interludes to give us all a break and let us catch our breath. So this one is going to be super short. I wanted to answer a question that was asked by one of the viewers. Uh, the question was, can we generate HDL from our diagrams? And the answer is yes and no. So Helmut Neiman's Digital, which is the program I'm using to draw these circuits, cannot export to the HDL we use for NAND to Tetris because that's a custom language developed basically for the class. However, it can export to the one of the two major, to both of the major HDL languages, Verilog and VHDL. So let's take a look. This is our half adder circuit, which is I picked because it's fairly simple. We'll choose export to Verilog. We'll say half adder.v. And let's go ahead and load that circuit. And here we can see we've generated some Verilog from our circuit. Let's do another one just to see if we get anything interesting. Let's take a look at our program counter, which is a sequential circuit. So hopefully the Verilog for that will be a little more interesting. And we can see that it's generated all of the necessary Verilog for our circuit. And it can also generate VHDL if your FPGA or hardware synthesis tool uses VHDL. And that's all I wanted to show you today. This has been programming like it's 1979. Thanks for watching.